balance and hearing are usually associated with each other because the organs that do the sensing of sound waves and that detect position, they're very close to each other, they're in the inner ear. They work in, in somewhat the same fashion too. Um, the the uh, cochlea that detects the sound waves has fluid in it and interacts by the hairs being bent by the fluid. Balance, on the other hand, has three little structures called semicircular canals arranged in an XYZ coordinate fashion. These three semicircular canals are filled with fluid too and are lined with hairs. And so if you bend a little bit forward, what you're going to do is cause the fluid to go in the Z direction and that's going to tell your brain, oh, I'm bending forward. Sometimes balance is not that important for animals. Three-toed sloths are awesome because they live in trees and they've evolved to be very, very slow. They rarely come out of the tree except to poop. And when they do, their movements in balance are very, very herky-jerky. The reason for this is that their uh, semicircular canals have uh, uh, started to uh, degrade. They're a really great example of how a sense is no longer needed and becomes vestigial.